అన్నింటికీ మనకు ప్రధానమైనటువంటిది సేవనే ఆఫ్ ఆల్ మోస్ట్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ థింగ్ ఇస్ సర్వీస్ ఇట్టి సేవను మనం మరచి రాబోయేటువంటి యొక్క భవిష్యత్తు గురించి విచారిస్తూ గడిచిపోయినటువంటి దానిని గురించి వగస్తూ కాలాన్ని వ్యర్థం చేస్తున్నాము we for, we have forgotten our bounden duty of rendering service in the community we go on worrying of the future and brood over the past kanuka prema sarupulara embodiments of love manam nirantaram kudanu sevara kante michinatvati ta sadhana manakute ledhu we have to recognize there is no other spiritual practice which is more than that of service sevanam kirtanam vishnu smaranam పాద సేవనం వందనం అర్చనం దాస్తేహం ఆత్మ నివేదనం ఇది అని మనం భావించుకొని ఇచ్చి సేవలను మనం మునిగిపోతున్నాము వి స్పెండ్ అవర్ టైమ్ థింకింగ్ ఆఫ్ ది నైన్ పార్ట్స్ ఆఫ్ డివోషన్ లైక్ సింగింగ్ లిసనింగ్ వర్షిప్ సెల్యూటేషన్ సరెండర్ అండ్ సో ఆన్ కనుక మనకు నిత్య సత్యమైనటువంటిది సేవ యొక్క ఫలితమే ప్రధానమైనటువంటిది the consequence and the results of our eternal service is most important to be kept in view aadi purushulu itti sevana chetane danyulai poyaru in fact that is the cause for our liberation and redemption right from the beginning manam nirantaram kudunu parlok seva chestu raavali we have to offer incessant services to everybody and nimittame ee kaayamnu bhagavanthudu anugrahinchadu for that purpose this body is gifted ee dehamu కేవలం తిని త్రాగి కాలమును వ్యక్తం చేసే నిమిత్తమే కాదు ద బాడీ ఇస్ గిఫ్టెడ్ నాట్ టు మేర్లీ స్పెండ్ టైం ఇన్ ఫుడ్ రైమెంట్ షెల్టర్ డ్రింకింగ్ అండ్ ఈటింగ్ అలోన్ కనుక ఈ దేహమును పరులకు సహజీవులకు సాధన చేసే నిమిత్తమై అందించినాడని సత్యాన్ని గుర్తించాలి వి హావ్ టు రికగ్నైజ్ ద బేసిక్ ఫ్యాక్ట్ దట్ గాడ్ హస్ గివెన్ us this body to serve the neighborhood everybody in society కనుకనే ప్రతి మానవులు కూడా సేవలో పాల్గొనాలి హెన్స్ ఎవ్రీ వన్ మస్ట్ పార్టిసిపేట్ ఇన్ సర్వీస్ సేవ కంటే మించినటువంటి ఫలితం మరొకటి లేదు దేర్ ఇస్ నో అదర్ థింగ్ దట్ ఇస్ గ్రేటర్ దెన్ సర్వీస్ Sai group for coming out here. Uh, I'm Pastor Norbert down at Dulac in Louisiana after uh, Hurricane Ida. They're really offering some good support here and um, you know whatever we need. They look like they're open to it and I think it's an amazing connection that we've made there and uh, a relationship that could be for a long term. And uh, we really are going to enjoy our relationship with them and the support that they're bringing for us. appreciate the Sai group for bringing in the supplies to us to do lot Louisiana. Uh stuff is greatly needed. We've got a lot of homes destroyed, people are homeless living, you know, 10 people in in one small trailer just so they can survive day to day. Uh we've got needs for food, school clothes for the kids. Pastor uh, Bernal Dean and I pastor the church in Cambridge, one of the hardest hit neighborhood for Hurricane Ida. A lot of our members are suffering and really going through uh, hard times, but we are greatly appreciate this great great ministry, Santa Sa International Organization for the supplies that you gave uh 2 weeks ago right after Hurricane Ida. Today the St. Mark United Methodist Church partnered with the Sri Sathya Sai International Organization for Community Health Fair. Organizers of the event say this event helps the community stay aware of what's happening inside of their bodies. Some of these organizations their their role is to uh, promote awareness 
related to health issues. Not everybody gets all the care which is required. And the reason we provide this care is we are making patients and guests aware that what's going on with their bodies. Volunteers from the Shri Satisai International Organization partnered with St. Mark's United Methodist Church to facilitate a free medical camp serving residents of the Baton Rouge community. Volunteers from Texas and Louisiana surveyed the facility, finalized a layout, and publicized the camp prior to the event. The camp was open to the public on June 11, 2022. SSSIO volunteers assisted in registering guests, ushering the participants, assessing medical needs, and coordinating booths for partner organizations. Additionally, dental hygiene kits, food bags, and raffle items were distributed to attendees of the camp. This was the first health screening fair facilitated by the SSSIO in the state of Louisiana, and over 50 guests were served through this project. We decided to have this medical camp because uh, after so many problems and storms, uh, this was a felt need. The impact on an event like this to be able to provide resources for the community, uh, it's, it's super exciting. So many people have such a fear of going to the dentist and you know, I wanted to show them um, and provide information to help guide them. And we actually we are also particularly excited that we were able to partner with SSI with a lot of vast experience in this minute in this area. I like the experience because it uh, helped me see Louisiana's people and how much they value to get help for people. I really had fun experience with the doctor. Hi, I'm everyone. My name is Mahi and for about one year now I have been tutoring. It's not something I originally thought I was capable of, but after a few months I really started to see some amazing benefits. I realized that the best thing I could do for Swami above all things was offer my service to others and that's really what inspired me to do it. And overall it's just given me so much confidence and gratitude and it's been an amazing experience. Thank you, Siam. Hi, um, this is Annette. Uh, I participated in the USA training program for the refugees in Texas. Uh, I would love to read um, a couple of quotes um, of Swami that inspired me to participate in this service program. Bhagavan Baba once said, You are not doing service for others, you are doing it only for yourselves, to the God in you, the God who is equally present in others. He also says that pure and selfless love must express itself as service. I feel that the people who we are serving, they are the ones who are actually doing service to us by graciously accepting our service, and that is a blessing in itself. Uh, may some blessing and grace be with us and with them and with everyone that we can serve.
Mm-hmm. Yeah, just before I was getting into the community, uh, I found this person crossing the road uh, with a backpack and um, I, I asked him uh, if he would be interested in, in, the, in the food basket. He asked me, what does it have in it? Uh, so I've shown him the, the basket and, uh, uh, and he was like, wow, oh, okay, I, I, can, uh, I can take it, but what's the occasion? Why are you giving it to me? Well, we just, uh, we, we have this, uh, we signed up for a program. Uh, um, we were to, able to get a dinner to deliver today. deliver food. To uh, have somebody eat dinner. Every day. Yeah. Uh, and, and that day was, uh, in our turn and, um, and we, we, we were looking for, for people, uh, who could access the food basket. And he said he, he would, he would definitely, he would gladly take it. Uh, and I was fortunate enough uh, to, to find that person and I thanked him uh, for accepting the meal and he was really pleased and um, he, he mentioned that you know these are really cool stuff you know you really want to give it absolutely and if you like it it means a lot to me Sairam, I am with Viga and today we did a tree planting seva. It was lots of fun because I got to work with my friends and plant trees. We got to help adults plant trees and bring mulch and sand for them to plant the trees. It was so much fun. Sairam. And so when we would go shopping, we would get, a, we would be shopping for four or five families. And so this one time we ended up at the checkout counter 
And the person who was checking us out said, shopping for four families? Well, of course, we were like, yes. And we decided to tell them we were helping the Afghan families. And it turns out that the guy was really nice and he pitched in some money in order for our groceries to be bought. Well, I'm Ibrahim Mujadidi, and I'm a part of our community, Afghani community. We started the, uh, we heard that the people are coming from Afghanistan and everything like this, and they're all new in here, and there a lot of them are coming in, and they, they need some help and all that. So as a community, we came up to get the started. We started in uh, September of last year, and Sai community and everybody else that, that they have helped us they brought donation for us and everything we collected all and we distributed to so far we have distributed to 310 families uh, it's a truly rewarding uh, humbling and, and enriching experience uh, you cannot measure in words uh, what uh, what uh, we go through and and and, and uh, how you feel when you share these food items uh, with these uh, with these refugees with these displaced people Partnering with Sai has helped us tremendously, honestly. So we give them breakfast before we start. Then we take as many pictures as the kids want. They dress up, we plant, we and we grow together. So we appreciate it. Bajan bi nazuk shanti nahi. Hari bajan bi nazuk shanti nahi. Hari naam bi naanand nahi.